Welcome to clickmyproject.com. Now let's see about exposing digital image forensics by illumination color classification. Let's see about this abstract. In this method, we propose a method to detect the forensics in the photography. For that, here we use the SVM classifier for the forensic detection. Initially, we have to identify the illuminant map for the input image. Then we identify the face from the photography. For face deduction, here we are using the Milo Johns method in MATLAB. After, fa after face deduction, then we identify the statistical features. It is uh, such as the statistical feature is such as energy entropy correlation, sum of energy and sum of correlations are calculated. And then uh, we also extract the LBP feature. LBP represents the local binary pattern. After extracting the lo local binary pattern, we identify the histogram. This histogram will be used as a feature. Then the extracted features will pass to the classifier for training. Uh, here SVM stands for the support vector machine. It is a binary classifier. So it will learn the classifier based on the kernel based technique. The trained classifier will predict about the image whether it is original or forensic image. This is the flow of our process. Here we have we have two stage. First one is the training stage. Second one is the testing stage. In, an, uh, in this process we have to give the whole database image to the process so whole pro image is passed to the illuminant map for identifying illuminant map we are converting the image to the one color form to another form such as y cb cr y is the luma component and uh, cb and ck are the blue difference and the uh, difference chroma component from the components uh, we are getting the color Im map image so it will pass to the phase deduction technique for detecting the phase here we are using the Weiler John method. It identifies the phase based on the R features. It is a statistical model of the shape of object which is iteratively deformed to fit a, fit on example of the object in a new image. After identifying the phase it will pass to the feature extraction. Here we are using the two techniques that is LBP feature and the SISI statistical feature. So LBP is the local binary pattern. It will create the binary pattern to the input phase image. After that it will go to the statistical feature. It will calculate the statistical feature such as energy entropy correlation to the detected phase. The detected phase will be uh, trained with the SVM classifier. So uh, after that in testing, te testing stage we have to give the testing image. It will go to the illuminant map and then we, uh, we identify the phase in that image. For the phase, we identify the LBP and uh, SISA feature. After this feature will go to the trained classifier. The trained classifier will predict about the image whether it is original or forensic. Now let's see the demo of our process. Here I am having main.f file. Select this file, right click and run the file. This is our guide design. So initially we have to train the face images to the database. This is the trained features of our database images. In input image, in data set, totally I am having 14 images. First seven is the forensic image and second seven set is the original image. Now I am selecting one image as input. This is the selected input image. This ima image will pass to the illuminant map. This is the illuminant map. After the illuminant map, it will go to the face detection technique. These are uh, the face deduction, deduction tech detected result based on the Weiler John method. After phase deduction, it will go to the LBP feature extraction. These are the detected LBP features to the input image. After that, it will go to the GLCM feature. GLCM is the statistical feature such as energy entropy, correlation features are calculated. After these features will go to the SVM classifier. In deduction, we are using the SVM classifier. It will train and predict about the result. This is the predicted result of our 
SVM classifier it is predict as a forensic image now I am showing the result of exposing digital image forensic so here we are detecting the forensics based on the SVM classifier thank you